Hello guys, welcome once again. Till now, I have sh shown you how to generate reports uh, with the help of iText. And in this video and in the coming few videos, I will show you how to generate report with the help of uh, Jasper report or I report. So let's get started. First of all, you, what you need for generating report is I report installer. So go to your browser and write I report win Windows installer download. And first link that comes is I report designer version 4.7 download which is on the site Jasper Forge so I will click it and this window will open at the time of making the video this is version 4.7 and in the future it may be revised so keep in mind and then this is the Windows installer for iReport 4.7. So just click it and download it. I have already downloaded it, so I don't need to do it. And it's pretty simple to install. You just have to click few next button, next, 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 and you will be good to go. The second thing you need to download is Jasper report jar file. So go to your browser and write Jasper report 4.7 jar because my version I have downloaded for I report is version 4.7. I am downloading the same version jar file. Sometimes it happens that you have different version of iReport installer or designer and if you use other for example 4.5 version jar it creates some problem so make sure that your iReport designer version and Jasper report jar version is same and just it shows the f in the first link source forge site and which host this Jasper report download and when you go to the download site of source forge you need to download this zip file which have maximum number of downloads you can see here this zip file so I have also this I have already downloaded it so I don't need to download just download it and unzip it to your specified position after downloading these two things and after installing your iReport designer your iReport <coughs> designer icon will look like this so I will click it to open it it will take some time by the meantime I will show you how to add the jar file into your project just go to your projects and and go to the libraries here once again go to the project you're making and go to its libraries right click it go to the properties and it's taking some time to open 
and it's open now so this is the project properties window click add jar file or folder and what you need to do is go to the folder in which you have extracted your zip file jasper report 4.7 zip file this is my jasper report 4.7 i will click it and go to the libraries and you can see so many jar files generally you don't need all the files but i prefer to select all and press open okay and once again go to the jar file and once again the jasper report 4.7 previously you have gone in libraries lib and now you will go to dist here and click it and you also need to include these four jar files also and click open i have already have these files so i will not click open and after this all the jar file will come here and then click ok so this in this way you can install your i report designer and you can add the jar file into your netbeans ide and i think it's ready and this is your i report designer which looks like this and now in the next video i will tell you how to connect the database with this uh, i report or jasper report and how to use it in netbeans so I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial and please rate, comment and subscribe and bye for now.